In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install mods on PIC. So if you find the video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and like it. So this is very easy and helpful because it will let you add a lot of different features into the game. For example, right here I have the list of mods. You can install this mod to increase the player cap of your lobbies. You can also install this mod that lets you carry your mates even when they are not dead. There are mods for the backpack. There are... Uh, for example, this one lets you ping even if you're a ghost. There are like cosmetics and much more. There are hundreds of mods and people are creating more every day. So if you want to begin installing mods, you need to go to this URL. I will leave it in the description below. Or you can just go to Thunderstar, then communities, view all communities and right here just search for pick. So once you have done that, you should see the list of all the mods. So firstly, you will need to install this library that is required for all the mods right now. So just click it, open it like this, and click on manual download. Once you have installed this pack, you need to open it and open this folder. And this content is the one that you need to drag and drop inside your game's root folder. So if you don't know where you have that folder, you can go to Steam, then Library, Collections, and search for pick right here. You can search it directly there. Right click, manage and browse local files. So this will open the pick's uh, root folder and you just need to uh, drag and drop the content we just installed earlier into this folder. So in my case, I have this because I had VPNX installed already, but that's the process basically. Once you have done that, you need to launch pick at least once so it will create all the required folders so just open it and then you can just close it so once you have done that you can go to the bpnext folder inside your game folder we can close this already so this is the game folder we will see bpnext and then plugins so this is the folder where you will be installing any mod you want to install so let's do an example you can go to thunderstore then I'm gonna filter by most downloaded. You can do this or top rate it as well, or you can search uh, mods by name. So I'm going to install this one, for example, that will let you have more players on your game. So click there, then click on manual download, save the file, and now open it, and you should see this file. So every mod will be this file type, the DLL file, you need to ignore everything else you just need to uh, get this file and drag and drop it inside the plugin folder so just like this we drag and drop it inside the plugins folder in our game folder and now we can just launch the game and everything should be ready so you can do this process for any mod you want so i'm going to show you the same process for example with this one that will add more skins just to show you that it has been installed correctly so same process manual download then we open the file in this case for example this one is inside this folder because we don't see the dll file so it should be right here and we drop it inside the plugins folder so now let's run the game and let's see if it works so now i can use my passport just like this and you will see you have more skins than usual so the mod is working fine. So I hope it was helpful and thanks for watching.